All right, so this is the updated 20, 21, 22 season gear list. This is it. This is everything you need right here. I gotta say, this roller bag is amazing. Uh, it is specifically very helpful when your singer, Kendra, does not help you with any of the gear whatsoever. But so at least we're just gonna go through everything, set okay. it up, real time, yeah. check it out. So I like to take this up while we're out first. This is the Bose L32 Pro system, which I got from Sweetwater.com. Uh, definitely pretty much everything you should ever need. And everything that you could ever need is what he said. Sorry, if you get this I was one, far away. The roller bag is a must, 100% must. Okay. But again, if you want to get a different PA system, that's cool. I just like the bow stuff. Coverage is great. Sound is amazing. And uh, the thing I like nice about it is the mixer plugs into the base, which you're gonna see in a second. So you only need one plug. So I don't need to use like a power bank. So the next most important item is probably an extension cord. 100%. Stolen from my mom's garage, because nice. has anyone ever seen a new extension cord? No. You've probably got this exact same thing in your mother's garage. 100%. So make sure to steal that yourself. And then we'll knock that out. I am. This is a Jadario bag, which is kind of amazing. I love this thing because this pocket right here in front, you can put the cables in here so they don't get tangled up. This is gonna be the cable that connects the subwoofer to the Bose stand, which I'm gonna set out in a second. This is the power supply for the entire Bose system. That's all you need. Just speak louder, just in case. Okay, I'm sure. nervous. And then this is the tone match mixer plug that the mixer goes in to the Bose power base station. And that's essentially all we need with the exception of an XLR cable because we're gonna record the show tonight. So I've got the zoom recorder, which you're gonna see in just a second. So a small XLR cable right here. All right, so next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna set up the Bose power station. The nice thing about this bag is they have both of them in the same unit. This used to be two different bags for like the, the L1 Pro system that I used to use. So this is the base station right here. So sleek. <clears throat> Very sleek, right? This is where you plug the sub and the power into. They've come a long way. They really have. Kindred, Kindred and I have been rocking the Bose stuff for a long, long time. Correct. I still got the older one and it is so much heavier and I'm, I'd be eyeing this. Still, I'd be eyeing it. It's great. The, the old oh, for sure. Pro system is still pretty great. <laughs> it is great, but I'm just saying this new guy is looking sleek, looking nice and light. And there it is. So tower, tower array system, like literally that's it. And the cool thing Bam. is you can actually just plug your, uh, like a guitar and a mic right into this. But I still like using the tone match mixer just because, uh, like you have a little more control over the effects True. and stuff like that. So again, like I was saying, here's the mixer. All you have to do is plug this cable in there. And then now it will receive power from the base station here, which is pretty cool. Pretty cool. What we're gonna use to record the show is gonna be a Sony ZV-1 camera and then the Immortal Zoom H6. This thing is great because you can record the actual audio from the show and I'm also going to take the direct out of the Bose and plug it right into here. What's that called? The Zoom H6. Nice. And it runs on batteries. I just do the rechargeable batteries. Uh, I used to bring a power adapter with, but the batteries are fine. They'll go up to like six hours even. And then you just have one, then I do have to bring a power strip. So that's why I like those. I got a DR stand. We've been rocking out forever. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Definitely, if, you've, if you're just starting gigging or whatever, you need a boom stand. One of the first mistakes I made was not having the boom accessory and just having it stand up. And then you have a guitar, you have to like keep looking like that. And then the must-have accessory for this is one of these little like iPhone holders or phone holder right here. So we do a lot of requests and stuff for our show. These are like 15, 20 bucks on Amazon. Great investment. Totally, right? It's one of the littlest things that goes the longest way. Like, like, how did we do the without this? I don't this? know. We'd like hold it in our hands yeah. before yep. and stuff Very like that. Very unprofessional. But yeah, now, and especially like it hides it from the stand. So it doesn't even look like you're like mm -hmm. using anything. anything mm -hmm. right? It's nice and sleek. Yeah. Right, again, so, sleek is the word. Like I said, I'm going to plug the line out on the base here into the zoom. So that's basically gonna be good to go. And then I'm gonna connect the subwoofer right there into the Bose station. 
And then the power is gonna come from here. There we go. All right, now as far as like microphones, I think can- We just actually sing acapella. We don't even use this we stuff. We don't even need it, yeah. I'm pretty yeah. loud. <laughs> Kindred we just voice. like it to look cool. I know, right? <laughs> just it's, kidding. It's a flex. You know what I mean? <laughs> it's all about flex and making it seem like you know what you're doing. I think Kindred's voice is already beautiful enough as it is, but the only thing that makes it sound more beautiful is the Sennheiser 435. True. Love He's it. not kidding. Love these mics, and since we're an active show, we're performers. We don't like to stand still. We go wireless. So I've got the X5 wireless system. You don't have to use a wireless mic. You make it, you take an existing microphone, pop one end in here, and then turn it on, and then These make sure on the same channel. The best. And then Love you just this. plug this right into uh, mm -hmm. input one. Kendra gets input one because she always comes first in my heart. No. I know. What can you say? Aww. And then for the guitar, which I'll take out last, I do use the Sennheiser wireless unit. It's essentially the same concept, right? Mm -hmm. You turn both of these on. For the guitar. And they start blinking green. Or whatever you're. Which means they're syncing up, right? Mm -hmm. Synced up. A little guitar picture on that one, a little amp picture on this one. So this goes into input two. And then that'll be good to go once I get the guitar out. Goes in the guitar. Gotta make sure you have a guitar case because people need to tip you, right? Bam. That's what's up. I forgot I the twinkle generally lights. generally like playing the Taylor live, Taylor 816 CE. This new one you kind got of like, so cool with this. Yeah, right. With You've like probably that, already that. done videos on it, but not a lot. I probably no? should do like a follow-up. I just did the unboxing on this, and I've used it in videos. I love this guitar. But uh, yeah, this is like probably. I love all your guitars, but that one I've been also right? eyeing really like, heavily. Like, give me. Like this guitar is really kind of like the best guitar I've ever played. And then in the case, I've got like you know tuner, capo, picks, extra strings. Etc. Cetera, Etc. Cetera. Beautiful velvet. That that red Dracula velvet Dracula. interior. And then, quick like look. Hold on, hold on, hold on. That is just so pretty, man. This camera is awesome too. Dude, I know, right? You got yeah. the new. Why are you so swaggy with the new gear? Everything. This new iPhone. Da, 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 da. And then the most important part is the trek Sorry about my camera into the working. forest. Trek. Trek on, brother. They actually just landscaped this, which is nice. <laughs> I don't like know if you can hear him, but he said they just landscaped it. I'm not sure how the audio is on this thing. Oh, yeah, that's a shorter distance than some of the other statues. Oh, look at that sprint. Slow-mo. Oh, yeah. And that, got bada that. bing. Pop bada this on. Boom. Pop this on. Oh, it's a literal little hop. Uh -huh. <laughs> yep. There it is. Oh, my God. Oh, look at this view, guys. We've got a little art show going on. Just taking... I got another tripod for the camera because we're going to be recording this. Yep. I think this is like one of their... You thought we were done. No, 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 no. Nope. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, we're essentially that's the entire setup. That's all you need. Again, you don't need the exact stuff that I have, but a powered PA system I think is definitely key. And then... uh. It's really great to be on wireless. I've never really had an issue with any of this wireless stuff. I mean, Kendra, do you remember? We used to, we started out wired, mm -hmm. and then as soon as we went wireless, like the whole thing yeah. changed, right? Everything and then probably the actual most important part is you gotta get yourself a singer. You gotta get yourself a gorgeous singer that can do it all. This is probably the most expensive part of the entire rig Priceless. right here. But uh, anyways, we make do. So anyways, you ready to rock? Born ready. Fly through the night, fly like everyone I know, like everyone I've been conceited. Fly through the night, doesn't matter where you go, when you leave I feel so defeated. You don't know where you're from, you don't know where to go, don't tell me with your story cause I've got my own, never better. Just listen me to it. You come and go, but I love you so easily. I'm the sweetest damn thing you ever saw. Easily, suddenly you don't love me at all. Easily, three years later and now we wanna call. Easily, yeah. Oh, 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 easily.
through the night blind like everyone I know, like everyone I've been conceited. Fly through the night, it doesn't matter where you go. When you leave, I feel so defeated. No, you don't know. 